mama it's your girl adrian b you know what it is and tonight i am showing you how i make fresh homemade cotton candy in order to make fresh homemade yummy cotton candy like this mm. yummy you need a few things. You need your cotton candy cone or a cotton candy stick. You need your sugar. Your cotton candy maker, of course. <laughs> And your sugar scoop so this is flavor sugar but you can also just use regular sugar out of your um, kitchen just regular sugar so let me uh, let me see if I can see my car okay that's about all I can do right now all right, let's get to it. Um, if, if you are in this live, try to share the page. Um, but this will be just a quick way to show you how to make your own cotton candy. The machine that I'm using today is a nostalgia machine. This is a great machine, a great fresh cotton candy starter if you're just starting out learning how to make fresh cotton candy uh, for your family friends uh, little events at home or uh, treats and sweets this is a great machine to use um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my sugar and this scoop came with the machine I think it's about, I don't know if it's one or two tablespoons, but it came with the machine. And I'm going to just pour it into the center of the machine. And you see the cotton candy forming already. So you just take the cone around the machine. Now, uh, I had the machine running for at least 15 minutes before you put any sugar into this machine. This machine will not produce cotton candy before 15 minutes. It, it, and <clears throat> so if you put sugar in the machine before the 15 minutes, it will take much longer to start producing. But you see, if you wait at least 15 minutes, it will immediately begin producing cotton candy for you as soon as you pour your sugar into the middle. Okay, this cone may be all ready. So you can have fresh cotton candy cone. And it is yummy. This flavor is cherry. So if you have any questions about anything you see in this video today, you can put your questions below or you can DM me and I'll do my best to answer your questions. And the information to this stuff is down there. Look at that. Yummy. So, this is what one... Well, we still got cotton candy coming out. <laughs> I was going to say, this is what one looks like. But if you want fuller cones, such as if you're having a ch child's party or a small gathering or get together at your home
Okay, it's still producing. Okay, okay. It's doing its thing. Yay! It smells so good. I wish you all had smell on your camera. This is amazing. Fresh blown sugar. Now, this is one cone, so one scoop, right? Um, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to jazz it up a little bit. I'm going to, so before I started, I started already with one cone to show you all what we were going to do. And so this is another cone. I'm going to make one more cone before I go off of here. And any, it's springtime. It's Easter time. So any, you, you can make fresh uh, Easter basket treats for your family. You can just make fresh cotton candy. Okay, so we're gonna, first I'm gonna grab this, these little strings, and then I'm gonna wrap blue around this pink, and then we'll be done. So I have the blue, and it may turn purple, I don't know, or it may be blue, not sure, it might mix with the pink, or it just might, oh, it's it's its own blue. So, here we have it. And so, this will make for fuller cones. So, if you want it fuller cones than just one serving, you can pour one of these cups at a time and you spin it. You spin the entire cup and then you use another cup. It could be of the same color. It could be of a different color like I just did. But you never put more than one cup in there because it'll clog the machine. So you just put your one cup in there and you just spin. So <laughs> you just spin. It smells good. It's soft. Nothing is like fresh. Nothing is like homemade. Okay, we're almost done here. Are we done? I think we're almost done. <laughs> yes, fresh cotton candy. Mm, it smells just like the state fair. Yummy! <laughs> so let me taste it, of course, before we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Mm. Wow. Okay, so I already ate off of this one. I'll try to put the rest of this sugar, get it spun on this one. So, that's it. That's It is just that simple to make you a fresh cotton candy for you and your family. Make sure you follow us at SugarMamaCottonCandy.com. Please like our page. And also follow us on YouTube at Fat Boss Life and Instagram at 
Fat Boss Life or Sugar Mama Cotton Candy. Thanks for watching.